the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, spend in charity and do not count it, lest Allah count it against you. Do not hoard it, lest Allah withhold you from you. So we learned, again, her way, according to her son, was that she would just give it away. So she's teaching us, be in a state of gratitude, don't deny blessings, don't magnify incidents, because these are shaitanic you know, thoughts. When you magnify an incident and it overshadows a lifetime or years of experiences, this is what? What is it? Uh, is it Ghafran? No. Oh, thank you. Ghafran and Ni'mah. Thank you. This is ingratitude directly because shaitan wants you to hyper, uh, again, focus on one thing that was said to you, one thing that was done to you, and that you negate everything else. May Allah protect us from that. We never want to fall under the category of those who are ungrateful. In fact, we want the opposite. We always want, because, you know, the opposite of gratitude is kufr. So may Allah protect us from that. And then to spend in charity and to give away without counting. So this is really great, Nasiha. Sometimes, you know, we are in positions where we might have to give. And if you're the type who is worried about giving away your wealth, this comes from, again, a lack of understanding. May Allah increase us in understanding that never are we losing when we give for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Never is it a loss? It is always a gain. It is always an investment. So we want to, you know, really fight, do that majahid and nafs that we give. If, it, if you feel the impulse, just give and don't think twice about it. Don't let that internal conversation have, oh, maybe I'll just do half this time and then I can do it another time. And No. Nafs, shaitan work together to try to, you know, uh, prevent you from getting the maximum reward. So she's teaching us, right? Spend, don't count it because then Allah will count it against you.